Controversial rapper Azealia Banks is back in the news and now she's making headlines again because <laughs> this time she's blaming black people for ruining her rap career. Now, t uh, she got banned from Twitter from talking shit about a, a Middle Eastern dude. And, you know, uh, I, I, did she call him a sand N-word or something? The dude, I think his name was Zayn Malik or something like that from One Direction. Yeah, let me let me know in the comment section if I got that right. But basically, this girl, she, she's always saying something controversial. Uh, the last time we heard about this heifer, she was killing chickens in her closet, <laughs> performing witchcraft rituals and stuff. Literally, no, no, she, she wasn't killing chickens. She was cleaning the blood out of her chicken killing closet. Excuse me. She wasn't killing chickens on camera. She was cleaning the closet. She was cleaning out her closet. One more time. Shout out to corny ass Eminem. But anyways, here's what <laughs> she wrote. I didn't even know she had a Twitter anymore. But Azealia Banks wrote, <laughs> literally, my entire career went down the drain once I started trying to explain myself to the black American masses. Once I started giving a fuck about what black Americans thought of me, I got distracted and lost it all pretty much. It holds me back a lot, as most of my audience is European and South American and don't really cute, I guess you meant to say, and don't really quite understand that black American female ire. And black Americans try to act like I'm completely crazy, laughing out loud. I'm not fighting for anyone's rights in this 26th year of life. Everyone can kiss my ass. I don't care about any issues this year. Buy Chi Chi and write about my music. Thanks. It's all about me this year. Don't ask me about LGBTQ. Don't ask me about race. Don't ask me about feminism. Don't ask me shit. So I just wanted to give a shout out. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to sound real vulgar when I say this. But all you stupid black bitches that were on Azealia Banks side riding with her because you thought she was some sort of feminist or something. It, it really, if I'm not mistaken, I guess she's a womanist like her bestie, Cola Booth, who I interviewed. If you never heard my Cola Booth interviews, I, didn't, I interviewed her twice. Just type in Meat Magazine, Cola Booth interview. I wanted to interview Azalea Banks, but she, when I tried to talk to her on Twitter, this is before she got banned, she wouldn't do it. She, she didn't respond. But the thing is this, though, man. Azalea Banks threw black men under the bus she has some violent things to say about black men. She wanted black men to go to jail. She even wanted black men to die, didn't she? I, I, if, if my memory serves me correctly. And black women sat back and didn't want to say shit collectively. There were no major articles written about it or anything. Remember when she got into the fight with Wale? I made a video about it. Type in Wale, Azealia Banks fight, Meet Magazine. The video pop up. But yeah, you know. She really shitted on black men real bad and black women just basically ignored it like as if she didn't say anything at all because they didn't care. Now she's basically saying fuck you too, <laughs> heifers. The funny thing about it is not only has she gone off on black men, Middle Easterners, let me see who else because she, she's done so much shit. I think she was caught on video fighting in the club. She was fighting in an airplane. She was fighting a, did she, did she assault a female or a male bodyguard another time? I mean, she she's always doing something, guys. She's no angel. Let's just be real here. Real here. Azealia, like I said, the last time we heard about her, she was cleaning out that chicken killing closet. Where she would do her rituals or whatever. So, psh, it was like blood and feathers in there. See, I don't know what I'm talking about. Just, just type it in, Azealia Banks chicken killer or something like that it should pop up either on a search engine or youtube it should pop up with no problem but man you know i i i think she needs some help at this point you know now that she's throwing black people collectively under the bus it's just fucking ridiculous but she is who she is i don't know whether or not she's just doing this for publicity to get people to talk about her so that people will buy her music or whether or not she's really that crazy what do you guys think publicity or just plain fucking crazy Anyways, this is all my opinion. What do I know? I mean, she is a pretty girl, so I, I'm supposed to be on her side. But every once in a while, a chick gets kicked out of Team Pretty Girl because she just does something so wrong that she uses she loses <laughs> she loses a Pretty Girl card. Azealia Banks lost her Pretty Girl card. She's still fine. She's a nice looking chick, but she she can't be in Team Pretty Girl with 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 some of her ridiculous antics with the violence and and and, and everything. She just she she just doesn't she doesn't have the qualifications
But anyway, this is all my opinion. What do I know? Just a rap music fan with a microphone. Let me know what y'all think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit Meat Magazine. Blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine, Meat Magazine 7 on Google Plus, Meat Magazine blog and Instagram. Be sure to hit the notification buttons right next to the subscribe button. It looks like a bell, which should look like Azalea Banks because that would be a nice looking button. Now, uh, you might be saying to yourselves, Jesus, you, you want the button to look like Azalea Banks, even though she gets on your nerves? Yeah, because fine, it's still fine. Now, uh, once you click that button, you'll be set alerts to be notified when new videos get posted. Oh, before I go, boom. Do you think. What she's saying about black people is offensive. I say, hell yeah. At least she didn't say the N-word this time, though. <laughs> Heffle.